Welcome back, everybody. Um, today so, is. I got excited. I thought it was something new and something easy, but it's not. It's not. So, I don't know. Words going on the street. It is a Beijing pattern. Uh, it's 39 feet, 26 mils of oil, and it won the two. It's, so, it sounds like a sports challenge, not a PBA, so. Maybe a little bit easier. <laughs> <laughs> easier, but, but uh, patterns right here, and um, we are on the way. I mm -hmm. think she's improving a lot. I'm starting to make sure my especially on short patterns, especially on the short patterns. But I'm starting to improve a lot by uh, trying to keep my balance and really follow through through my uh, aim point. I'm starting to learn some, learn a lot of things because uh. I didn't notice the other day playing on, on bass practicing. I got so used to playing the short patterns that I started going for that break point of three, but it's not always going to come back. So I got to really pay attention to I believe the rule of 31, trying to keep that break point uh, better, so better entry angle. And uh, but today, <sighs> yeah, I've been working on <laughs> like keeping my elbow tucked. Um, the way I throw and shorter steps so she doesn't throw as fast and uh, use le less arm and more leg we're trying yeah. to get her to get uh, to be a little slower on the approach because she's probably getting a little too fast and getting off balance and leaning forward and still working her steps but that's gonna yeah it's so it's awkward well she's been bowling like her off step for a little bit that she got used to it I mean to break that habit get into the good habit Good form. Immediately. Good form means good scores. If you uh, and start hitting your marks a little bit more consistency. So, but we hope you guys are enjoying this content. Hope you make sure the, you like and subscribe and turn on the notification bell if you want to see more. But there you go. Oh, you let's have time. some fun today. <laughs> Later, guys. Pretty good. One eighty two. I thought he was gonna be really good. I got cocky. You got frustrated. And... Yeah, cocky. So we're slow down. Keep that. Remember we practice slow feet, elbow in, and we're gonna do a lot better. But you hit that at eighty seven. I had a one ninety two, yeah. and it's tough. Mmm, your ass. Alright, game two.
game done, I got a 113. I kept it clean till the 10th frame and I got a big split. And so I got like a 160? Oh, somewhere. I don't remember what I got. But I got like a one. I got a big split in the back end, so I couldn't finish off with a strong finish, so. <sighs> but doing good. I think I'm, gonna... I'm doing good. 192 with a big 160 or 170, so uh, we're going to keep pushing forward. I'm Hope moving, moving balls to so a big, big ball, the one that hooks the back end. A lot, a lot of, a lot of urethane today. Yeah. Almost everyone's putting urethane. So, it's good to me. But I need him to hook now. <laughs> One, two game, three, five. Um, it was a good day. It was a bad day. Started off kind of rough, but at a, overall it was pretty good. It was good. So yep. I had a 178 average, 534 series. My strikes were only 35% today, so it wasn't that great. But my spares were almost perfect. A 93% on most of my makeables. I only missed one single pen of all things. Damn, seven pen. Like, first one, I think because of that one, I lost. I should have had a 182 average, but I didn't. I didn't pick up my six splits. A couple rough breaks. Um, I, all in all, the spare game saved me. So, yeah. First game, played the pocket really well. Um, just missed that one spare, so... Didn't get that 200 I wanted. Second game, I was trying to find the right ball um, that go through the pins the best, and just kept just kept keeping the good count, good good spares. And then I had my third game. I thought I figured it all out, but still with these patterns being so difficult, you gotta really watch your hand. Sometimes my hand was just going a little behind around the ball, not staying behind it, so I wasn't getting that full turn back in, and. On the second and third game, tenth frame again. I'm in that tenth frame curse. Two splits. Uh, well, ten, split in the second game of the tenth, and the split in the third game of the tenth. And it was wow. <laughs> but uh, would you come with today? So my first. So for the first game, my score was a 84, and that was. I couldn't figure out anything. I couldn't find my spares, couldn't get strikes, couldn't get mm -mm, nothing. Well, you started off kind of rough. You were just kind of like, you weren't like, I don't know, with the right head. You were kind of rushing, kind of, I don't know, nervous for some reason, it seemed like. God, you calmed down and then you started like going over the stuff we worked on this last week, slowing down, keeping the elbow yeah. in. And then she started getting behind the ball really well. And then because of the wrist brace, it was going into her wrist. So she. Just, stole my tape and <laughs> I'm probably gonna continue selling his tape because the wrist brace kind of conflicts with the way I, I kind of need to move my hand that's why I quit wearing my wrist brace and I just started doing some wrist exercises <laughs> yeah but uh, second game I got a 113 which was a good comeback but I only got that due to the last the last few um, frames because I actually started focusing and uh, I started paying attention towards one like one line 
and somehow I didn't like lose track of it. I just like glared it down, and then I got two sh like a double strike, and then an eight in the tenth frame. Yeah. So all in all, good day. One of these days, they're gonna probably put an easy pattern out there or forgivable pattern. Let's say easy. Forgivable. Because none of these <laughs> patterns, no pattern we're probably ever gonna play on is gonna be easy. Uh, most be challenge or uh, harder. Today was a good day, keeping good count. Was nine, nine, nine was annoying, but you just gotta power through it, keep hitting your spares, and eventually the strikes will come and or keep that score up. But thanks for coming out. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. But see you in the next one. Bye guys. Peace.